Hi, everyone. I'm Monsignor Jim Vlaun, and welcome to this, our final Virtual Arch Media Awards. Barring any unforeseen circumstances, this time next year, we will be together for a broadcast award show from the beautiful Sheen Center for Thought and Culture in the heart of New York City. So this year, while not together, it's still such a blessing to celebrate all of you and your great work. To echo Monsignor Vaughn's sentiments, as far as we're concerned, we will be together next year for our first ever nationally broadcast on the Catholic Faith Network, celebrating this great multimedia journalism program. Until then, once again, we present this virtual award show to honor you and celebrate the fantastic videos you all produced that tell the beautiful stories about your wonderful Catholic schools. Not only do we honor the students who created these videos, but we express our sincere gratitude for every pastor, principal, and teacher who participated in the production of these entries, but more importantly created the very Jesus-centered culture upon which these videos are focused. This year's Arch Media program saw submissions coming in from all over the Archdiocese as schools from Westchester to the Bronx and Staten Island participated. And my job running the Catholic Faith Network is to spread the good news about Jesus Christ and how he taught us to live our lives to as many people in as many places as possible. So this year's theme, Where Do We See Jesus in Our School, was very near and dear to me. And just like here at CFN, this year's entries utilized sharp editing, complimentary music, sophisticated cinematography, compelling narratives, and even a dose of good humor. In order to convey this most spiritual narrative, in addition to the winners, we'll give you a taste of all the entries so you can see what your fellow Catholic school students submitted. And the only way we could do this was a quick compilation of all of the great entries. So have a look at this. school, we see Jesus everywhere. We see him in our classrooms, our hallways, and our worship center. However, Jesus appears to us in many different ways as well. Jesus reveals himself when I pray to him. Jesus presents himself to the knowledge of our teachers. I see Jesus when my friend shares with me. I see Jesus when Nurse Amory cares for me. Jesus lived a life of perfect kindness. He healed the sick, fed the hungry, and cared for the poor. This year, our school participated in our second annual Acts of Kindness Challenge. Through this challenge, 
Jesus appeared to our young disciples and guided them to achieve over 5,000 kind acts. Whether our students are at work or at play, Jesus is always noticed in their hearts, minds, and souls. I see Jesus. I see Jesus. We see Jesus everywhere! especially in our classroom. Every day we start in our classroom. In our classroom, Jesus gives us the opportunity to learn about how the church began. Jesus gives us the opportunity to have a great school environment, great teachers who inspire us daily. Here is a list with some of our inspiring teachers who help us live the life of Jesus. How has Jesus shown you the way to teach us about him and the Bible? Jesus has shown me the way to teach about him and the Bible by giving us his overall message and by guiding me just like the Holy Spirit would guide us. Where do you see Jesus in the school? I see Jesus in all the actions of all the people in our school. Our adults work so hard to help everybody and our students work together and that is Jesus in our school. God gives us the opportunity to take care of his creation in our school. As students of our school, we are stewards of creation by taking care of God's creations and helping the environment. We see Jesus in his Father's creation, such as the outdoors. When we were in our school's prayer garden, we had the opportunity in the safe place to pray to God throughout our test, our classwork, and our normal school days. Jesus is seen everywhere, whether it's the, the crucifix in each classroom, our friends, and our church. We see Jesus in the crosses, statues, and bulletin boards at our school, but Jesus is really shown in our staff and students. Jesus has been our school's focus since the beginning. Jesus has helped us through the good and bad and continues to inspire us to do good works for our school and church community. Jesus continues to help us spread his word throughout our school day. We see Jesus constantly in our teachers and students. Here are some of Trent Fig's own to tell you how they see Jesus in our school. This is Karen from the seventh grade. Today she's going to tell us where she sees Jesus in her classroom. I see Jesus in my classroom pretty much in everybody's hearts. The way people treat me and just the way the teachers are. Everybody's so nice and you can really see the influence of Jesus. This is Mrs. Chester, the first grade teacher. Today we're going to ask her, how do you see Jesus in your staff and students? I see Jesus a lot um, in the staff and students. My students really want to be a part of the community and the school and they always have great ideas how to help out in the classroom and around their neighborhood. And the staff were really supportive of all the students and want them to succeed, so Jesus is in all of us. This is Owen from the fourth grade. Today he's going to tell us why he loves Jesus. I love Jesus because he sacrificed his life.
I'm Lance. And I'm Lance. And we're with Mount Media News. News. Students all over the Archdiocese have been looking for Jesus. We get an update from the front gate. It's a possible Jesus sighting, so we're going to head on over to the front gate right now. Here at Mount St. Michael Academy, we see Jesus when students are greeted by name. Emilio, Juliano, Josh, Chris. It seems like we have another Josh, sighting. Let's head to the cafeteria. We see Jesus when we pray together before meals and break bread together. There's been a sighting in the fields. All right, heading to the fields right now. Behind me is a couple of athlete students actually preparing for a good game. Come on, let's take a look. Lord, when two or three or more are gathered in your name, you are there. Send it over to you in the classroom. We see Jesus through the actions of our students and faculty members in every interaction. Let's take a closer look. Hold on. Yeah, I'm reading news that the attendance has just been sent in to the main office. Hey, Miss Nolan, I gotta ask, is Jesus here every day or marked absent? Jesus is present here every day at Mount St. Michael Academy. All right, back to you guys to you. All right, folks, there you have it. Jesus is present every day at the Mount. Well, this is all the time we have for today. I'm Lance. And I'm Lance. And this is Mount Media News. My name is Jill Luciano. I'm Alexa Brito. And I'm a Christian. I am Pentecostal. And I'm agnostic. The fact that he made it possible for people to feel love it makes me feel like I'm like in a warm hug and it's just like full of affection. Jesus is just open to all and loving. People will say in a literal sense, you see him in statues. Um, I'm pretty sure you could just find him right there. I mean, all around us, we have images of Jesus. But if you think about it, Jesus is everywhere. I see Jesus in all the Preston girls, even in the small acts, like somebody holding the door, complimenting each other. That's where I believe I see Jesus in the school. I believe if you have faith in him, which is believing without seeing, then he's there. Jesus is love, Jesus. I can, I can be a person like Jesus was. Jesus, you're out of uniform again. Good morning, Farrell. We have some breaking news. Jesus is in our school. Jesus inspires confidence in the classroom. He helps us learn more than calculus and AP Bio. Or Shakespeare and economics. With Jesus, we grow in our faith. Our teachers demonstrate the virtues of Christ. Kindness, patience, fortitude. We see Jesus in the morning prayer. We celebrate Mass weekly and on holy days. We see Jesus at confession and stations of the cross. Jesus is present in our community service. In our Brother Life food drive. Honoring and serving our veterans. Raising money for charities through FOSSI. Jesus is with us on stage when we perform. He's even at our poetry slams. Or even on Wall Street. Jesus inspires creativity in our hearts. We project Jesus in messages through our voices. Jesus inspires tenacity and dedication. Grit and ferocity in our athletes. Whether we are on low cross fields. Battling on the gridiron. At the ice rink. During the 100 meter dash. During my chaplain spent. And even on the wrestling mats. He helps us over many hurdles. We see Christ in Monsignor Farrell's mission. Farrell inspires integrity, scholarship, service, brotherhood. We see Jesus in our friendships. Jesus is with us at Farrell always. Here it goes! And that's it for today's broadcast. Remember, Jesus is with us here at Farrell always and with you. And don't forget, church on Sunday. See you soon. While we are certainly highlighting the top rated submissions, it is important for all of you to know that each video is a winner documenting the characteristics that make your school uniquely Catholic. It is an honor and a privilege to lead our legendary system of Catholic schools in the Archdiocese of New York. Please know that I am so proud of you, your classmates, and of course your teachers and principals. Keep up this great work 
and keep making all of us proud. I know you will. Well, there you have it, the 2022 edition of the Arch Media Awards. Now start thinking now about ideas that you may bring to next year's Archies when we plan to gather together at the fabulous Sheen Center for Thought and Culture in Manhattan. Did someone say red carpet? Until then, have a safe, healthy, and fun summer. God bless you all. Mm -hmm.